Hello, my old family. Um, I'm, I wanted to step in here today and talk um, a little bit about Mend Your Mayo. So I'm getting a lot of questions about it. Um, and I'm having some excellent conversations with you guys. So many of you guys are reaching out to me f because you're learning about me from some of my other wellness warriors, um, some of my colleagues who are, are either um, sharing about their journey with me, they're sharing their tongue-tied journey, they've been through therapy with me, that kind of stuff. Um, so these conversations that I'm having with you guys are really kind of like blowing your mind on how myofunctional therapy and wellness really come together. Uh, a lot of you guys are learning that it's not just about that tongue tie. I'm having conversations with you about your breathing, your fight or flight, your digestion, your tongue posture, um, your sleep. So, so many of you guys, your sleep is in the dirt and you just think this is normal. It's not, and your body has to repair and clean and rejuvenate and all those things during sleep. So. I, uh, I'm i really the why gal. So many of you guys have been to other practitioners. You're saying, well, I have high cortisol levels or I just don't sleep good or I have restless legs or you know all of these things. I grind my teeth. Um, my doctor wants to inject Botox into my cheeks. Um, but the biggest thing that, that many of you guys just aren't thinking about until you get to me and I'm saying, but why? But why do you have this problem? So I am part of your of your wellness toolkit, okay? So for many of you guys, I'm that domino that just tips things over. So um, a lot of you guys are asking about Mend Your Mayo, which is open. Um, in this program, um, I teach you 10 lessons. So this program is really for an audience who either doesn't want to work with me just solely one-on-one, -on -one. they don't have the time, they have geographic differences, maybe some financial challenges right now that just make doing traditional one-on-one -on -one therapy challenging, and that's totally okay. That's why I do this program is because it's more of, of a group therapy type of setup. Um, so we do it in a live Zoom room, and I can see you, I can correct you, I can give you feedback, all of that stuff. Um, and, and so where this differs from working with me one on one is it's just that there's going to be other people in the room. And sometimes there may or may not. A lot of clients who do Mend Your Mayo, they just watch the replay. Um, and so I just take that time to teach you. You have that one on one support and that feedback versus doing something like Mayo to go, which is just a, a hundred percent video based. You really don't have um, any feedback or um, or coaching, you know, in that program. So for you, if you're on your wellness journey um, and you're just finding yourself bumping up against obstacles, like this is just how I am. This is just how I sleep terrible. Uh, I'm putting on weight um, and it's, uh, it's just how I am. And remember, it's in my world, it's not about the weight. I do get a lot of questions like, do you work with people who are overweight or do you work with plus size people? Which is so um, strange to me. However, I can totally see why people ask that because what they're, what those clients are asking me is, Carmen, everything else in my life is out of control and I just feel like I can just, I can control this tongue tie thing. So I just want to focus on this tongue tie. Yes, my sleep is terrible. Yes, my digestion is terrible. All of that stuff. But can you work with me and keep your mouth shut about the fact that I need to move my body and um, and and have self care and take care of myself? Um, and I just want to work on this. But this is a, a piece of the puzzle, and there's a reason that many of my clients say this is like the domino that just tips and knocks everything else over. Uh, many of my clients say, you know, before I started, I felt like a bag of poop, felt terrible all the time, no energy, no motivation, making terrible food choices. And then by the time we work through therapy, their digestion has improved, their sleep has improved, they have simmered down. That's one of the first things that we start looking at in therapy is why, you know, what why why you have this stress response, why you're why you're um so high strung or anxious or whatever that emotion is. Many of you guys wear that like a badge of honor and it's enough. It's it, we have to stop saying, "Hey, yep, I'm a high functioning stressaholic." Okay? We need to simmer that down. So 
So I call that simmer down sister because we just have to get you calmed down a little bit. Um, some of that has to do with breathing. Some of that has to do with tongue posture. It certainly plays into your digestion. So when we go through Mend Your Mile, I take you through all of those things. So in these 10 lessons, um, I teach it in a little bit more condensed package, if you will, because um, normally when I'm working with somebody one-on-one, -on -one, I'll teach 12 sessions and it'll take us about six months. So in Mend Your Mayo, I'm teaching you the tools. I'm not meaning for you to hang out with me for months. I'm going to teach those 10 lessons in, a, in about um, 12 weeks. You know, we start July 5th, we go through until September. And in those sessions, you're going to learn all of the tools that you need to go forward. So when I teach you something in that kind of a container, you're going to be learning, but you're going to be implementing them on your scale. Okay, so it's definitely DIY. And I'm going to give you support on that. Um, <clears throat> a lot of questions are coming in about tongue tie. Yes, I'm going to give you guidance on the tongue tie. Remember, if you want to do what I do with my one-on-one -cl one clients, then you need to work with me one-on-one. -on -one. Um, I start therapy with my clients two months ahead of a phrenectomy. I have a specific you know, pre-procedure, post-procedure protocol. If you want that exactly, then you have to work with me one-on-one. -on -one. But in Mend Your Mile, I'm going to be saying, okay, if you're going to have a tongue tie release, here's what I want you to be able to do before you have that done, okay? Obviously, if I'm gonna teach these 10 lessons in a matter of you know, 10 weeks, 12 weeks, clearly you're going to, to be doing some stuff on your own. I'm going to give you all of the ingredients. You have to build the recipe, okay? I lay it out for you. So if you're good at following instructions, you're gonna do fantastic. Um, and so everybody's journey is going to be a little bit different. I have some of, uh, of students now who are going through the program who aren't going to have a release till the fall. So they know that everything's not going to be perfect right now, but it's going to get better as they have their release. Now, um, so registration is open for Mend Your Mile. We close that on July 2nd, and then we open um, the first session up on July 5th, okay? So if you want to get registered, um, if you find me on Instagram, you can find that link in the bio. If you're finding me on Facebook or in any other groups, the link should be there um, or somewhere right around there, okay? And then um, the other thing is schedule an exam. So many of you guys are asking about scheduling an exam. Do you need to have an exam to enroll? No, um, because remember, this is your program. Um, everybody who has tongue posture, mouth posture, breathing, chewing, swallowing, digestion issues, there's something to gain from myofunctional therapy. So you may not need all of those areas. You might need all of them and then some, okay? If you're a complex human, um, you might want to work with me one on one. But if you are a complex human and you don't want to or can't or whatever um, do a traditional program, then do this. It is certainly, certainly, certainly better than doing nothing. Um, and so you can schedule an exam so that I can know more about you. <clears throat> And what I do when I do an exam is I can then say, okay, so when we get to lesson four, when I'm teaching you A, B, and C, here's how I would like you to handle that. Um, I also, if I do an exam with you, I can give you more individualized feedback. I can also tell you, yes, I think you would benefit from a tongue tie release or holy cow, you have some concerns. I think you should talk to your doctor about a sleep study. So I definitely think an exam is in order whether you do it before or during is fine. Um, another set of eyes sometimes gets you headed in the right direction. I send hundreds of people every year for a sleep study, and that may not excite you, or you may feel like, eh, I have no interest in doing that, but sleep apnea is the most chronic, degenerative, deadly disease that there is, and it's killing people in their 40s. So I think it behooves you to know whether you have um, a, a sleep concern, okay? Uh, and quite often, myofunctional therapy is a great place to start, dealing with a tongue tie if you have one, that kind of stuff. So if you have questions, book your exam um, and then make sure and get registered because like I said, we're gonna close that on July 2nd and then I do the first lesson on the 5th. Um, as we get closer to starting, you'll get your workbook, you get your success guide, all of that stuff. So um, message me, email me, 
get a hold of me somehow if you have other questions, but make sure you get your spot. All right, guys, I'll see you next time.